Hello, good morning. This is teacher Jacob, and this video is for uh, seventh grade. Today, we're going to study uh, pages uh, 114 and 115. It is about reading comprehension. We are going to start new new uh, unit. We're going to start unit 10. And unit 10 is very interested. Uh, last class, we were uh, talking about the auxiliary can and and that's what we study and how can you do questions and answers with that. After that, uh, we have to do some uh, kind of project. Of course, we're not going to do the project because we don't have time and because the year is almost finished. But uh, this is, is, is unit 10. You know, this is a reading class. This is what we need to study in this section in this unit. Unit 10, it is about music matters. Uh, you know, something that is very interesting, especially for learning English, is music. So question one for you is what is your favorite music? What is your favorite uh, singer for you? Especially in English, of course, because in Spanish is something a little different to uh, English. So if you are interested in learning English, what you need to is, you know, to choose to select your best singers in English, in English uh, the best music that you like to listen all the time. And of course, I insist, of course, it's necessary to memorize songs in English, okay? So, talking about music, as we know, music has different kind of genders, I mean, different kinds of music like uh, rock, pop, uh, what else, uh, pop music, uh, just talking in English, uh, country music, classical music, gospel music. Even if you are a religious person, you can listen to uh, uh, this kind of music. So what is music? What is the value, sal expression? Be the power in the world, be yourself. Music, in our words, is to have the power. So, for example, uh, with you, we study uh, the Beatles, we study music, Robert Williams, we study uh, to be a better man. You know, the music is giving uh, a, a message for the people, and that's what it, it counts. So listen, nice music, listen, nice singer, and you will learn a lot. Well, now, number the things according to importance they are to you. For example, for me, for me, music, and, and so. So you need to choose in order to you, number the things according to you, for example, uh, for me, it's the most important thing. It's uh, let me see. Uh, for for just giving an example, okay. Uh, giving an example, it is, uh, for example, uh, number one. So I write here for me, number one, it's uh, friends. If I have friends, for me, oh, for me, family. Okay, uh, family number two. Uh, what else? Uh, music. Okay, music for me is number three. So you're going to choose food. Uh, well, food is very important. So four. Uh, school. School. Well, school. Yes, school is five and six. Cloth. So according to you, according to what do you like to do, you're going to do this. So work in pair, uh, work in pairs, compare, and discuss the number in activity one. So 
as I told you, for me, in this case, friends, is because if you got friends, it's like having family. So that's why, for me, it's very important, this. So what we're going to do in this reading, notice this, we're going to read on page 114, unit 10, uh, reading comprehension, talking about this. Of course, if you look at the pictures, look at the pictures, you will notice and you see the pictures and, and then you have an idea on, on only one direction. You're going to see that this reading is going to talk about music, about rock, about groups and singers, perhaps. So you got an idea that this reading is about music or post stars or something like that. So we're going to do three activities. Activity number one, it, I insist, is very, very important uh, if you want to understand reading comprehension to choose to select words that you don't understand. Okay, out of this, for example, you have to uh, circle, you have to circle, check it out here. So you have to circle, let me see, circle or underline the words that you don't understand. So for example, uh, I don't understand this, so I, I give a circle. Uh, I don't understand what it means. Uh, where else, uh, let me see. Uh, biggest. I forgot what it means. Biggest. Uh, I forgot what it means. Uh, where? Where? I don't know what it means. Where? Uh, so, activity one, look for the unknown words. Look up the words that you don't understand in the test. And don't forget, it's possible to write a list here. Yeah, it is possible. And it's wonderful that you try to separate the words that you don't understand. Activity two is listen and read mentally, right? So you're going to listen and then you're going to read mentally. This is like an audio book, okay? Uh, this is also a spectacular for... Uh, um, for uh, um, for uh, understanding, I mean, uh, if you listen and read mentally, you are going to have a general idea. So listen, read mentally, don't speak, concentrate. Remember, reading is concentration a lot. SSR activity number two, reading, read and listen at the same time. One, two, three only one direction on the road with only one direction most people have a negative imagine of tribute bands these are music groups that play music of a well-known ad but do not include any members of the original band they often wear terrible costumes produce at a cost acoustics and give concert in a small uncomfortable location but one direction the biggest boy band in the universe has a tribute band that does does things differently only one direction for performs in front of crowns of 10,000 fans at festival they have pledged in dubai and have flown in private jets to exclusive birthday parties. Now they are preparing a tour of the U.S. Now bands for five ordinary boys: Henry, Aaron, Jamie, Andy, and Matt, who imitate five fav five very famous boys: Harry, Leon. Sanyon, Lois, and Neil. These fans are great, amazing, explained 23 years old Londoner Henry Allen. Henry mimics Carly Hare's fans' favorite 
Harry on a stage. They love anything to do with One Direction. They follow us on social network, and we are always communicating with them. The band, the band loves being famous on the stage, especially without any of this stress and pressure of being superstars when they are on off stage. People sometimes stop them in the street and ask for an autograph, but they usually live fairly normal lives. But isn't all glamour? The boys often get up at 2 a.m. to get to the thing, a jing, and they do it with all the help that they will, that they will want the option has. They buy their own tickets when they travel, install their, their equipment on the stage, and put on their own makeup. After shows, they usually stay back, everything up. All of them love performing, but in a career, imitating other really want to dream of. We want to play our own music in the future, they all say. We hope they do. For the moment, they are enjoying being a very successful reboot and all right so this is a listening exercise number two so activity three is do the the comprehension so so the option is you can read a game i mean you can read normally if you, you, you want to read a game so on the other room with only one directions and read a game and answer the questions on the next page. Now it is, this is very important too. This is an idea, this is a suggestion for you. Reading a tribute band, responding to a text. While reading, develop your personal reaction to the text. Identify interesting, surprising, and confusing details. This will help you to relate to and understand the, the information better. Work in groups, discuss the questions. So you are going to do activity one, two, and three, right? According to the reading, this is a reading comprehension of words. Uh, what a, what an international famous girl or boy band do, you know, of, you know, off. So uh, this is like a personal uh, question for you. So it's a singer that is not singing now. Tell me one. So what international famous girl or boy bands or, uh, or boy bands do not know of? So, okay, this is international. Well, I don't know exactly in my case, I don't have one a famous singer because I, I, sometimes I listen, sometimes I forgot to continue following him or her. B, which one do you like and why? So according to this kind of uh, famous uh, singer in the bands, uh, so tell, tell me one. For example, I remember Tracy Charman, it was wonderful and now it doesn't work now, okay? So look at the picture, uh, number two, look at the picture in the article and guess who the boys are. Read the article and check. So you need to look at the pictures and tell me who are they. So you need to tell me the names of these boys. So here you got a list of this boy's name. So you, want, you have to write the names of them, okay? Good. Three, read the text quickly and underline the correct option to complete the Saturn stage. A, only one direction play in front of 1,000 or 10,000 or 100,000 pounds and a festival. So this is like a comprehension, okay? So you, 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 you're gonna choose one. For example, you choose 10,000 
answer, okay? That's the answer, 10,000 points.